too easy. All right, we're back. We had a week off. Why? Because I was in serious trouble. <laughs> 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 no, I wasn't doing so well. Why? But I got uh, got a bad fever and it yeah knocked me about. Knocked you about? You sound like you're a deflated green balloon. That's yeah. What you sound like. No, I wasn't. I was in uh, bad shape. Very, very bad shape. It was a glandular fever. It was glandular fever. If someone comes up to me saying, oh, you got kissing disease, I'm going to lose my shit. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. You've got kissing disease, Carl. Oh, man. <laughs> the amount of times I've heard that. Oh, what have you been up to? <laughs> Fucking nothing. <laughs> I haven't done a thing. That's what's so sad about it. Well, you couldn't speak this time last week, hence the break. Oh, uh, yeah, I physically couldn't speak. I couldn't eat. Mm. And I fucking hate soup. <laughs> I hate soup. soup. You're All, done with soup. I'm so done. Week and a half on soup. <laughs> if I have to, like, if you said die or have one spoonful of soup, I'd die. <laughs> <laughs> I, I couldn't do it. Honestly, I couldn't do it. Potato what? soup for a week. You eat potato soup for a week. <laughs> you have that for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Why potato? <laughs> I don't know. This is what we. This is what it was. Well, chicken like helps your throat. I couldn't swallow chicken. No, but like the chicken. Chicken soup. noodle. Chicken noodle. Chicken soup. noodle yeah. soup. Yeah. I would have had chicken noodle soup without chicken and noodle because I couldn't have eaten it. No. I would have had to drink it. That's what I had. That cup of soup. <laughs> it's like it's just hot water. <laughs> That's what that I had. disgusting. No, I hate that. It's that cup of so soup. bad. I had that for a week. That's revolting. Yeah, I know. I felt awful. So, no sleep. No, I just didn't sleep for about a week. That's, yeah, that's like, good. Actually, that's not exaggerating as well, isn't it? I reckon I had half an hour <laughs> a night. I reckon I got maybe half an hour each night. Not I was just sta- staring at the clock all night. Really? <laughs> Do you know what that feels like? To uh, stare at a clock I for don't. 12 hours? Yeah, I don't really want to know. <laughs> Woke up at 3.30, just go watch TV. I literally gave up halfway through the night. I'm, I'm going to go watch TV. <laughs> I've almost finished Better Call Soul in two weeks. Oh, holy shit. I was up all night. Just I might as well go watch TV. I was about to, um, I was about to ask. That's a complete lie. I haven't almost finished it. I've knocked out like three seasons, but yeah. still. I was about to say, how many um, TV shows or movies have you watched? Oh. And what has been your favourite movie from... Your time under glandular fever. My favourite movie, gee, I've seen a lot. I watched a couple of classics. I watched I watched the whole Harry Potter set. How good's Harry Potter? It's good, but like if you're not in the mood and you just push through them. You wouldn't have been in the mood at all. Oh, I hated it. I'm like, <laughs> what are you waving sticks around, calling it magic? I'm like, how about fucking fix my throat? How about that for magic? You may have oh. Are you in like the worst mood? I was ever. in the worst mood, but I couldn't talk to anyone, so I had to text everyone. Can you get me some soup? Really? Like, I had to text people. Text mum, text dad. Dad, dad, uh, dad was a bit, you know, dad was dad. When it comes to being sick. Why? He's like, mum was like, oh, can you go do this for Kyle? He's like, you're sick. What do you want me to do? Yeah. I can't do anything. He's sick. <laughs> so dad responds. Yeah. I was, he, and then I was like, so I was basically passed out, but awake, but on the couch, sweating, just like, I can't move. Mm. And he wanted to go to bed. He's like, you good to turn the lights off and lock the door? I'm like, <laughs> dad, if I can walk to my bedroom, that's a win. <laughs> that's a win. So I'm going to walk to bed and all the lights are going to be on. You had to text that to him as well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I was trying, and I was trying to talk to him and I was like, oh. yeah, I just couldn't say a thing. Get one of those voice to, uh, text to voice mm. translators. Yeah, things. Stephen Hawking. <laughs> <Carl Yeah. laughs> Literally. I was thinking about it, translating it for him so I can talk. Mm. But no, nah, it's been a good week. Besides that, you can speak now. I obviously. can talk now. It's Complaining's good. back. Yeah. Oh, that was so quick. What? As soon as I can talk, I complained so much. <laughs> Mum was just like, "Shut up." <laughs> Is it the worst you've ever felt? That's the worst I've ever felt. Yeah. Worse than COVID can't be as bad as the dreaded COVID. Oh, I'd have that four weeks in a row. <laughs> Compared to glandular. <laughs> oh, the, what I had, my experience with COVID was a piece of piss. So that didn't bother me. I've had the flu. That. That was pretty rough, but nothing like that. Everyone wants to know where you got it from. Oh, God. If, if they could find out for me, I'd love to know. Because the lady friend doesn't have it, does she? No. 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 Perfectly fine. Absolute Absolute bullshit. Fine. (laughs) Bullshit. I am in a world of pain. Yeah. Oh, man. Not good. Yeah. 
golf balls in your throat. Literal golf balls. Yeah. It's like I was swallowing them. You it's like I've been at a golf V1 range. In his throat. I pro literally. one right there. Oh. Right here. <laughs> they did, <laughs> the golf cart that collects all the balls stopped working, so they yes. employed Kyle so to go. go <laughs> fucking <laughs> swallow them off the ground. <laughs> and they got just stucked. Stuck in my. Oh my God. It was insane. You look like Poe off Kung Fu Panda when he's trying to fit all his dumplings in his mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Carl Barnes, ladies and gentlemen. Wasn't far off it. The Dragon Warrior. The Dragon Warrior. <laughs> That's what this episode's called. The Dragon <laughs> Warrior. That is this episode's title. Oh. oh that it? was the thing as well. I couldn't even laugh. I couldn't watch comedies because if I laughed, it hurt. Really? Yeah. Do you know how sad that is? Did you cry a lot? Oh. Waterworks. Like, was there a moment where just, you just I like, just, fuck this? Yeah, I, yeah. It broke me mentally. Mm. I was just like, no, nah, I'm done. This is... But it's... You know what I hate? Talking about this, knowing someone else has had it, and they're like, yeah. yeah it's I'm just waiting for them to be like, yeah, wasn't that bad? <laughs> like, mate, this is fucked. <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, someone else said, yeah, it took me three weeks. It's going to take me three years to get over this. <laughs> Jack, how long do you reckon you could go with glandular fever? Mm. Until you just say no, I'm out. Tap out. If I had the Delta strain, maybe like two weeks. I'd probably be the same as Kyle. Well, I'm lucky. I'm all good now. In terms of like sick, feeling sick, I'm alright. See, I'd hate it. I would. I, I couldn't do a week. I'd tap out. Weeks tough. First week is so yeah. tough. See, I've had tonsillitis, and probably most of the audience has as well. Yeah, like, that's we've common. all had tonsillitis. Yeah. That feels like, you know. Similar. Cheese balls in your throat. Yeah, it doesn't feel good, does it? That's not good. You can't swallow. You can speak, though. Yeah. I, I'm not sure about this no speaking deal. That I don't know how that bad. works. Yeah, I know. And didn't you wake up in like a pool of sweat as well? <laughs> like multiple This is times? just disgusting, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is <laughs> you for the last week. Yeah, nah. Well, you yeah, look a lot different. That's awesome. You, you know how many... All right, here's another thing. Everyone's coming away. to me. Gee, you look like shit. Oh, yeah, it's fucking... I haven't seen you for two... Yeah, great to see you. I'm so happy we're catching up right now because I look like shit. <laughs> Carl's like, I want to go back into my bedroom. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to really. You look like me. I look... Nah, You've only got me by two kilos now. Yeah, how's that? I have like a severe fever... Still got him. <laughs> Still got me. Just. And I've been doing 50 push-ups and sit-ups a night. That's not bad. You are malnourished. No, nah, but he eats a lot. What does malnourished mean? What do you, you mean? Don't, you don't get the right nourishment. Very, did very she said that wrong? You did, you can't, okay, that's something I don't like. When someone explains the word by putting the word in a sentence. No, it's true though. You look malnourished. It's like. It looks like I haven't been eating enough. Is that yeah. Or you've not been getting the yeah. right nutrients. Yeah. I've heard it a thousand don't. times. I've always just nodded my head, pretending I don't know what it oh, means. Oh, malnourished, of course. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah, nice guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Sit him down in the pub a couple of days ago. You've thrown out a few gags. You're back. Maybe you should get this more often. Yeah, I know. It might actually make me funny. Yeah. We'll see. A couple of laughs. Yeah, that's it. I've used them all up. Good to be back. We've had a week off. Nox has gone. Yeah, Nox has gone. He'll be back he's next day. He's been talking about it for weeks. Yeah, now. he's been threatening to quit yeah. for a while now. <laughs> I mean, he's fucking he's pulled gone. his. Yeah, he's gone. He'll be back next week. Yeah. Tom, it's your farewell episode next week. Yeah. Yep. So everyone get onto that. That'll be fun. We're going to get him pissed. Yeah. And I won't be able to fucking drink. But you can't right. drink. That's yeah, I can't thing. drink either. On the waters. First episode in a while, I reckon. Yeah. Very. First time in a very long time. I haven't had one beer. All right. We're black. All right. Yeah. Quick intermission. We're back in black. We're men in black. All Mo right. We're back. Do you like that movie, Men in Black? Fantastic film. I haven't yeah. seen it. I don't watch any Will Smith movies anymore. How, how is my mum's shepherd's pie? It's quietly. The shepherd's pie was delicious. It's, it's disgusting. Fun. No, it's fantastic. It's the only meal, everyone has a meal that the family cooks that they don't like. Shepherd's pie is mine. I can't stand shepherd's pie. Yeah. What's There's yours? this one. Oh, what is it? I don't know. Sometimes just, we'll just hammer home one meal really often. <laughs> for like three weeks We'll have it like seven times And I'll just be like This is fucked up Can we like stop? Like I really like it And just because I say I really like it Doesn't mean I want it Every night Kind of thing Or like every th third night Yeah It's in it's excessive And I don't want it anymore And then I s get sick of it Then I'm angry that I'm sick of it Because I like it Yeah exactly. We did that We had chicken It was like chicken pasta Yeah I reckon I had it Honestly 
four times, five times in two weeks. Oh, and I was like, so often. Like, I know it's easy to make, mm. and like, I'm happy I'm not cooking, but I don't want it. Did you say, Mum, I'm look, the chicken pasta? That's enough. I said, Can we try something else? <laughs> It's a polite way of saying it. Oh, yeah, I'm like, how about, can we, can we have like anything else? Or you just show them some recipe you found. Mum, have yeah. you seen this recipe? <laughs> oh, it's good. You do the old, do you remember when we used to have this? Oh, <laughs> that is, that always You are works. like, yeah. oh, you made a, gr- oh, that was so good when you made that. Yeah. Do you remember when we used to have it every Friday? Mm. Oh, we when should, we should do that again. Yeah. And then they make it. What Fuck, can I that chicken pasta? <laughs> <laughs> can you, uh, can you guys cook for yourself? Yep. No. <laughs> If someone was to come round and like to cook, I'd put on a show. Yeah? But if I'm left on my own, I'm not cooking. Okay. But I, I'm able to cook, if that makes sense. Right, yeah, okay. Can yeah, cook, so, chooses not to. Yeah, that's right. So if you're in a survival mode, you could cook for yourself. Like, you're living by yourself. Because I had the same thing. Not chicken pasta, chicken fajitas. When I lived by yeah, myself, nice. that, I just had those, like, so good. two, three, four times a week. Because they were just so easy. And I'd get the little kit... And I'd have a little fajita night by myself, lonely in my room, alone. Yeah, I do dark. like. It. Sounds like us. Yeah, <laughs> fajitas, fajita, fajitas, good. You know what I really didn't like when people just had tuna and rice. Yeah, oh. like that's like not even trying at this point. Like I just, I just felt like uncomfortable to be in the same room as someone eating tuna and rice. Well, I don't. I feel uncomfortable around tuna all the time because it stinks. Yeah, I can't mm. stand the smell. But someone eating tuna casserole, tuna not rice. bad. No, yeah. it stinks. I don't think I like rice. <laughs> I think it's rice. Rice is good because you can mix it with sauce and the sauce yeah. takes over and it's just like eating. It turns the sauce into a food. Yeah, I okay, can with you. But Great there's point. sometimes when you have it with like rice and something and it feels like rice is just on the bottom. Yeah. And then you're just eating it at the end. And no. I don't like just eating rice at the end. Yeah, I know. Because there's if always it's too through, much rice. Like there's no way matter, too much rice. There's always too much rice. No I'm not, like, I'm not eating whatever. all the rice. Yeah, exactly. So you're won't. always stuck with just a heap of rice at the bottom. Mm. But on that tuna and rice thing before, I think if someone, there is, there's, there's something wrong. Like, you need to ask them a question like, are you all right, mate? If they're just eating tuna and rice, mm. plain, bland tuna. That's as rice. bad as my That's baked beans. dry as. Yeah. I can't cook rice, funny enough. It's a I burn the shit out of it all the time. Well, it's because you obviously don't watch it. But I watch it. When is it ready? When is rice ready? Wait, <laughs> why don't you just get the microwaveable packet? No, no. We don't have that. We cook rice like cook proper men rice. And yeah, men with yeah. water, with water and the stove. Yeah, no. Yeah. I've, I've, <laughs> yeah, it's not rocket science though. You just put the water in and just cook it and time it. But how much water do you put in? Aren't you supposed to put enough water in, but not too much? This is baffling. Doesn't like steam. Well, I don't think the steamed rice. Yeah, you it's not boiled rice. No, yeah, you put the what? Wait, no, yeah, you just put the water in and then you cook it. Very, very simple. You just follow the recipe. What recipe? There's what no recipe? It's the rice. rice. <laughs> just search it up online. There's no instructions on the rice packet saying yes, this is how is. you cook it. No, they literally is. You know how to cook it. No, you just wash it. You just, well, you obviously put the lid on and everything. Yeah, and you just let it. Let you it know, what? Steam, I guess, is the term. And when but is it's it in water, and you well, you have to check. You have to take some out and you try it. Yeah, I don't check. I, I I'm a very much a checker. Cooking pasta, I'm checking. You check. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'm not having hard. Pa- What's worse than spending twenty minutes cooking like spaghetti bolognese? The bolognese part is good, and you're eating semi-hard <laughs> pasta. <laughs> you eat the pasta, you're like, oh, not good. You can almost hear a crunch. When you bite into uh, it, yeah. hard pasta is no good. That's hard pasta. Horrible. I just eat the sauce. Hard yeah. pasta. Pass. Pass. I, hard I, pass. <laughs> <laughs> I went through this stage of like you know, almost yeah. uh, pretty good. Yeah. I went through this stage of cooking for myself, like whilst I was living at home with my mum and dad. Um, and then whenever I cook, my mum would be like, "Oh, is it good? Like, are you enjoying it?" And I once did that thing with the hard pasta. It was fucking horrendous. Like, <laughs> this meal was rancid, and my mum's cooking is really good. Oh no! Yeah. So, but I don't know. I don't know what I was. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know what I was thinking. I was on some fucking woke shit. I don't know. 
But I decided that I was going to cook for myself. And this fucking pasta was awful. And I just had plain chicken with it. Oh, and that's... Like peri peri chicken and this and hard pasta. Yeah, I've never really felt good. as sad when my mum pulled out this beautiful homemade pizza. Oh. She's like, how's the pasta going? Yeah, it's pretty good. Just fucking crunchy crunch crunch <laughs> in my mouth of this hard pasta. The worst feeling. Hard oh. pasta is no good. No good. Do you have to cook a meal like once a week or something? Nah, I, nah, I don't have that responsibility. Oh, okay. I have to cook once a week at least. Yeah, I've heard about this. Once or twice a week Do I have, have to cook. Do you have to go to? Yeah. It's ravioli, tortellini. Well, <laughs> it's easy. Good. Oh, so. So, no, do, Dolmio pasta sauce. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And bit of Napoli. Latina, whatever it is. It's good. Yeah, I get the good pasta. Tortellini. Feta, feta and spinach and whatnot. Yeah, it's cheating. It's uh, not a meal. No, nah, you cook you cook that and then you just, you know, you cut up a bit of this and that. You chuck that in. Put a bit of spinach in. A bit of iron, mate. It's good for you. Aye, there you go. Nah, it's good for you. You've just been schooled, son. I think if there's no easy. sizzle sound when you cook something, it's not cooking. Well, I can cook a barbecue or a steak if I wanted that to. That would be more appreciated, I reckon, in the Barnes household. No, they, mate, they appreciate the past. The past is good. I like the pasta. Carbonara? I can cook carbonara. Or does that not count either? Because you boil the the pasta. Yeah, it's the same thing. (laughs) That's cooking, mate. That's just how it is. Right. Just so so we're clear. It's not cooking unless you hear a sizzle of meat. Sizzle of anything. What if I buy, go to the poultry and I get uh, these really nice chicken kievs? Mm-hmm. But I cook them in the oven. When you pull them out, what sound do they make? Yeah, they. But does that count? Yeah, it counts. But I'm basically doing the as much work, if not less, than cooking the pasta. That's fine. Sizzle? S- sizzle. If it sizzles. Right, I have another one. Frying an egg and put it in it on some toast. Is that cooking? Is there a sizzle? Yes. You're a chef. <laughs> <laughs> but they're probably thinking concept. about your ravioli the same way you're thinking about their chicken and rice or whatever it is. Chicken pasta chicken that you pasta. mentioned before. Fuck, he's cooking it again. <laughs> yeah, same thing. Oh, yeah, no, really? that is true. He's going with a ravioli again. Mm. Yeah, I'd be like, no, nah, not ravioli, tortellini, but with the same sauce mm. and every condiment is all the same. So what foods were was happening? Oh, fuck, I've said that really poorly. No, you haven't even said it, really. Um, what, you know, what meals were your household cooking while you couldn't eat that you were like, fuck, I really want to eat that? Oh, that I wanted to eat? Yeah. Oh, man, where do I start? What was like? Noki. I wanted Noki. Noki's pretty consumable food. I couldn't eat it. Balls of dough. I know. I wanted it so bad. Pizza, I wanted back. Actually, you know what? I'll be honest. I wanted a Zinger Burger. So fucking bad. I wanted chicken that melts. Like a chicken burger where the chicken melts. I wanted to go to Schnitz. Mm. I wanted to go to Grilled. I wanted it all. And I couldn't have it. Except I was eating fucking soup. <laughs> oh, I'm not. I'm not touching soup. I don't even know if I've said this. You're already. off soup. I'm off soup. Yeah, soup's no good. Soup sucks. No soup for you. No, nah, no soup. Yeah, not having it. I can't believe you didn't get that reference. Let me guess. That, that is the reference. No soup for you. That's Seinfeld. Yeah. <laughs> At the yeah, I think I know that. There At the restaurant, yeah, I've got it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I watched a little bit of Seinfeld. I'll be honest. Have you? Yeah, a little bit, but like not enough to reference anything. Mm. How many seasons of Seinfeld are there? Nine. I reckon you could get through all nine seasons. At least you give me two weeks. Mm. We all have a show that we can blitz through. We all have a show that we can sleep to. Yeah. Sex education for me. That's crazy. In three days. It was incredible. Yeah. What a roller coaster. Mm. I like Adam Groff. Mm. (laughs) Adam Groff and his two Coke cans. Yeah. Yeah. Massive elephant's Uh, cock. Yeah. 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 Good show. Elephant trunk. Mm-hmm. It's a good show. But yeah, what's been going on in the world? Because literally nothing's happened in my world. My world has been sweating, couching, soup. My world. I haven't been up to heaps. I've been wanting to do this. This is fun. I miss doing this sometimes. This is fun. I felt oh. bad. I did feel bad because I was like, <laughs> I was texting Jack. I'm like, oh, can't talk. Like I literally <laughs> couldn't do a thing. I was like, I could try and do the, the, uh, the no, tech no. guy. We'll but have a break. Break's fine. Break is good. Even. Yeah, break. No, yeah. I wanted to do this. So I've been thinking of content, thinking of ideas. Got some cool stuff coming. Yeah. Um, other than that. Do we? <laughs> cricket. I hate talking about cricket, but I got the grand final this weekend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's good. I'll go watch that. Yeah. Actually, I'll probably fall asleep, but I'll watch I'll try and watch it. 
So, other than that, oh, today, I get pretty angry sometimes. Not around people, though. Like yeah, no, no one, you, you hold it in. No one thinks of me as an angry person. <laughs> Playing Smash Bros on Nintendo today. I wouldn't want to be near you. Oh, yeah. no. First time I've played in a while. Okay, that's always not going to be good. Yeah. This guy just played really annoyingly. Like Floyd Mayweather, you know, he boxes, he jabs and runs away for the rest yeah. of the round. Wins yeah. the round. Wins the round. Yeah. Good yeah. jab. <laughs> Good jab, right? So that's how this guy was playing. Right. Okay. So he just jabbed me, run away, and I couldn't beat him. He just kept pissing me off. Grabbed the controller, took it around the back of the house. No way. Put it on the big stump, grabbed the axe, chopped the thing in half. No way. There is no, no way. There is no but chance I'll throw you're a photo just up that. right now on the YouTube. No. I'm not joking. <laughs> I couldn't pick it up because it was so hot. The battery, yeah. I've chopped it in half. The battery was burnt my fingers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's, what, that's what happens. I said, what I've had enough. Like video games, I'm off them now. I can't do them. I'm past video games. I'm above video games. That Are you though? You just fucking lie. chopped your remote in half. You're <laughs> not above it. I can't it. do it. It makes me angry. I'm like, why am I doing this? I'm I'm the same though. I can't play because I'm too competitive. And if I'm bad, I'm not playing. Yeah. And it was pretty... I wasn't like yelling or anything. Dad, I had the controller in my hand. Dad saw me walk past. He's like, where are you going? I'm going out the back. I'm going to chop this controller in half. <laughs> <laughs> right. So just... For a bit of context, yeah. from your room to the axe things, probably thirty to thirty seconds to forty-five second walk. Yeah. So you've got thirty. You've got forty-five seconds there, just to contemplate what you're doing. Yeah. 100%. Then you have the interaction with your father. Yeah. Who says? So that slowed you down a bit. Like Jack, what are you doing? Mm. Probably going to like a minute thirty now. Yeah. So you've got ninety seconds of time to think about what am I doing here? I'm twenty-three years old. Mm. I've got a controller in my hand and you were still that angry at a randomer on Smash Bros that you it still It was a combination of the, the anger mm -hmm. and like, why am I playing video games anymore? I asked myself the question. That's okay to play video it's games. It's a waste right? of time right now. I could be doing something else. Yeah, it's okay to play video games. So I'm like, games. okay, fuck this. I'm grabbing it and I just chopped it in half. And the controller went so far. Like See, it, yeah. It's the fact that you've spent, like you just... Your anger was at a level where time wasn't relevant. Yeah, which Effectively, is crazy to me. That's that's where I'm like, because after a minute and a half, like I would have put the controller down, probably gone and punch something. Yeah. But then I'm done. But you're going to come back to it. This is what I taught, asked myself. I'm probably going to play again and do this. I'm going to be angry again. I don't want to do that. I don't want to go through that again. So you're just going to... So I ended so it. So was the chopping, chopping of the controller... It was a smash. The smash of the controller, yeah. did that signify, I'm not playing this, I'm not playing again? Yes. Is it like it stopped you physically from playing again? That's what it was. Okay, well then that's a bit different. Yeah. That's kind of, pardon my French, fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> that you have to go to that extreme to no, be like, I I'm not playing it. again, I need to cut my controller into two. But it's the only thing that would have stopped me playing. I kind of resonate with you though. Yeah. And I've judged you too early here because mm. I'm thinking of the stuff that I do on Saturdays. Mm. So after I get out at cricket and it is like a 30 second walk from you've just got out yeah. and it happened not this week, last week, mm. my girlfriend come to watch us play, oh. got out for a golden duck, no way. first ball out, bowled, leg stump flying everywhere. Yeah. No. I didn't want to be angry in front of, because Cal, Jack, you both know how angry I get when I get out. Like yeah. I just throw everything. Yeah. yeah, that is, it's hilarious. <laughs> and I didn't want to do that while she was watching. So mm. I trudged off like calmly and I got back into the changing rooms and just threw my shit everywhere. <laughs> so it's very, yeah, I can kind of resonate now. That, mm. Like, yeah. That and there was no so time annoying. that was going to, I was so flat for the rest of the day. Like, oh she's yeah, come, as you would be. Like it's an hour flight <laughs> to come and watch me play. Bang, first ball out. <laughs> <laughs> so what the fuck, man? <laughs> And she's gone. Uh, yeah. All right. Enjoy your flight home. I reckon her watching the game of cricket bored her so much and she's off. Yeah. Nah. Uh, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so funny. I actually haven't heard that yet. Yeah, fingers crushed. First enough. ball, middle stamp. Oh, man. It went flying as well. Did a couple of cartwheels. I was like, I was just watching it behind me. I was like, like watching the, just the stump just going tumbling over. Yeah. Your That's, bales yeah. went flying. Yeah. That's worst case scenario. Mm. Uh, yeah. 
Is it good to be back and healthy though, Carl? Yeah, well, it's good to be back. Yeah. Healthy is, you know, relative. You're not healthy. No, I'm fucking no way. But I'm better. I'm better. I'll give myself that. I'm better and it's good. Yeah, the new shoes, part of the uh, the old birthday present. The good oh. trip. Yeah. So that, yeah, that episode was probably the last time I properly had a drink. And I, oh man. That was a loose episode. That was, I haven't watched it because I can't. Mm. It's got good watch time. Like the yeah. average view duration was like 25 minutes. Oh, we're enough. talking statistics right now. Okay. Yeah, getting statistical. Statue. No, I just couldn't watch it because I just, I, I skipped to like, so I watched a bit of it and I'm like, oh my God, I'm drunk. Yeah. Like, I'm drunk here. I think we were all a bit tipsy. Apologies for that. Yeah. And I was just like, oh my God, I can't listen to myself drunk. I can't listen to myself sober. I'm not listening to myself drunk. You in the Spy Kids? Yeah. You want to watch more Spy Kids? Well, Spy Kids too. It's like, <laughs> I'm not listening to myself talk like an absolute dickhead. The spy Kids? Where's this coming from? I don't know. I was just trying to think of something I probably would have brought up. Is that but, what you've been watching recently? Like? Yeah, Spy Kids. No, I haven't actually. I don't know where that came from. You've been in your room studying astrology because you've got nothing better than that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I believe in star signs. <laughs> Some girl for Kyle's birthday. Um, Is this getting in? Yeah. Well. Yeah, message TLP. Uh, <laughs> do you know we did the birthday episode two weeks ago? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah she messaged Pisces season or whatever for Kyle's birthday. Oh. And Kyle hates that star signs. Thank you for messaging me. I appreciate the birthday wishes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm but not even sure if she said Pisces. I've never um, seen happy birthday. It was just flat. Pisces season. Yeah. And Kyle wasn't happy. <laughs> I think I, I think I sent you a message straight away. Yeah. Like. <laughs> that was pretty per- funny. Personally, my, I can give my opinion on this. I fucking hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's stupid. I just don't understand why. I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it when it's used to as label like a, people. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And like when people use it as like a, like it's a fact in an argument. Yes. Yes. This is ridiculous. I'm like, you you're can't. You're such a Gemini. Yeah. You're oh, such a. So, if up. someone comes up to me and says, oh, you're such a Pisces, I will get so angry. <laughs> like, oh, what gave that away? My birth date. <laughs> That's a joke though. Like, all my personality. <laughs> <laughs> There's a girl in our school who she used to ask like what day you were born or whatever and she'd know immediately and then that would set the tone for her relationship with you so if you were say a gemini or pisces or whatever she Mm. would then act in a different way just to kind of be in her astrology cloud whatever it is okay i found it the it's the strangest thing how can you determine do you what know how some, what your interaction with someone is going to be based on where and when they were born? Do you know how angry that makes me? <laughs> 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 Fucking talk to me and see if you like me. No, exactly. <laughs> You're a Pisces? Oh my god. Fuck off. <laughs> Oh, Pisces and Cancer, we'll never get along. Well, yeah, not if you fucking think like that. Yeah, yeah we could get along. Oh, let's get along. Let's, let's get along. It. Let's have a talk and let's find out. Yeah, let's chat. But also, if you like star signs, then probably let's, not going to work. Let's not chat. Let's get the bill. <laughs> let's get the bill. <laughs> yeah, I can't. You know, I'm not. Just do can't you, do that stuff. Do you pay for the bill? I pay. I pay as well. It's good. Good manners. I oh. Yeah. Okay. What? So there's a thing though that you have to do. What? As as a well as a guy, you always have to pay, and we'll always pay. But I personally, mm. I'll be off you if you don't do this. What? If you don't do like the pretend fight for the bill. The pretend if, fight. Well, not the pretend fight. Like no, no, no. Offer. The offer. If you don't offer, I'm off. Like I'm not doing it. <laughs> You'll but still pay. I'll still pay, but I'm not coming again. No <laughs> offer. I'm if, off. if that you, is pretty stiff. No, you have to do the. Mate, literally, don't even have to try to offer. Just, are you sure? No, oh, are you sure? Are enough? you sure? Like, oh, no, nah, I can get it. Most people do yeah. that. I haven't ran into someone before where they're like, so you're paying. No. And being serious. I saw. No one has ever said that to me, but the yeah. bills come and they've just looked at me. Oh. oh. <laughs> and I knew this was over And I'm like Oh I forgot my wallet <laughs> No way And she's like And she's just like Are you serious And I'm like No And I just paid Yeah And I was like You this suck <laughs> Like Like And she was like oh. Was it dinner? Oh, it wasn't even dinner It was just like I don't even know what it was It was just like Yeah 
yeah, getting mm-hmm. something to eat. And this is I obviously didn't go well. Dinner's yeah. good. I like Many years ago. Dinner. Dinner's good. Breakfast. I'm so big on going out for breakfast. I don't like breakfast. Breakfast is no good. The only Bref- thing with breakfast, breakfast is, is that fantastic. I love yeah. breakfast. Give me two coffees and scrambled eggs, thanks. Amen. Hash brown and bacon. I like making breakfast I'll see at home. home. Going out for breakfast. Is I don't, I'm never really hungry. Great. I never finish the food and I feel bad. Dinner, I'll mm. scramble the food. Smash it down. Yeah. 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 No, that's fair. But Go, fuck me. Going Getting back there. to... Sorry, just to rewind a little bit. Going back to the date thing. Yep. I saw this thing on Instagram um, of this couple talking. Well, not a couple, but like they were, they were dating. Okay. So they've, they've been on this first date, mm. and I'd like to hear your guys' opinion on this. Been on this first date. The first date was really good, according to this guy. Okay. Like they got along well. Like they were feeling some kind of vibe, whatever it was. Yeah. Mm. Second date, they're organizing it. She's like really keen over text. Like he even screenshotted the text messages and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And she goes, so will you be getting an Uber for me or will you be picking me up? That's what she said to him. And he said back, um, no, I'll be making my own way there via public transport. You can do the same <laughs> if you would like, or you can buy yourself an Uber. Mm. If a girl says this to you, what are you doing? Mm. I'm not buying a Uber. <laughs> I'm not buying the Uber. After one date. How many dates until you start buying the Uber for her? Well, that's um, the thing third. I offer to do. I don't expect someone to message me and say, are you giving me, are you yeah, buying me an Uber? That's yeah. what I didn't like. The expectation. The of, expectation. Yeah. I didn't like that. Yeah. I didn't like that one bit. Yeah. If I, I'll offer, I won't offer. I'll pick you up. Well, I don't, sometimes it has to be a special thing. Like if you do it all the time, she looks disrespected. And yeah. yeah. And then you fucking dash in thirty five dollars on an Uber every every couple yeah. of days. You no, know? nah, I'm I'm not sh- I'm not a fan of the when there's when it's blatant expectation. Not even like a. It's like the same thing with the bill. It's like, oh, are you sure you got this? Mm. Yeah, yeah, no worries. I no, it's fine. I got this. I'm yeah. going to pay for it. Yeah, I'm like paying. There's, there is no way I'm not paying, right? <laughs> because uh, that's what I want to do. I want to pay. Yeah, I asked you out. I should be here. I'm paying <laughs> I'm for the paying. meal. That's how I feel about it as well. Like, yeah. if you invite me out, I'm probably still paying. Yeah. But, like, <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, you, ever you can a, pretend like you're going to pay. Yeah. Have you ever had a girl pay for you? Yeah, when I've had no money. <laughs> that is a great story. That was embarrassing. That was, yeah, it was when like I heard 40 that. bucks, though. Oh, no, right. it's not that bad. It's not too bad. It's embarrassing, though. It's funny. Go on. Please delve into more detail. No, no he just went on a date and couldn't pay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um, yeah. I don't... And I paid for two yeah. previous yeah. ones, so let's just relax. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That yeah. was funny. That was very funny. Yeah. Mm. Got Public one paycheck, goods. lost it in two days. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I go through the money. Yeah, you do. Boy, I got tax back. Yeah, Did good you time. Good time of year, yeah. Massive. How good's getting tax back? Yeah, how good's not paying tax? Because we don't earn enough money. Earn enough yeah, money. we're just fucking sad. Anyway. <laughs> really? I don't pay heaps of tax. Fuck, that's immense. I don't earn heaps, though. <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, we're, so we're scraping by. Yeah, like I don't have savings apart from the Europe trip. Once yeah. I come back from Europe, I'm... You're fucked. I'm fucked. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. I'm gone. Yeah. Oh, that's Do you reckon funny. Europe's going to be the peak? Peak of what? His life. Yeah. Like, I always think no. about this. Like, what day is going to be my peak? And then where's it going to go down from there? Which is quite a sadistic way to no. look at life. No, there's no peak. Like if you there try and make something your peak, it won't be it. It'll come surprisingly. Oh. This is the best day of my fucking life. Like, yeah, something will pop up. Surprisingly. But if you, if you try and plan a day, let's make this the best day of my life. It's not going to be. It's not gonna it'll be fun, yeah. but there'll be some day down the line where you're like, oh, you look this at your mate. Oh, cool. this is pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Well, I've, I kind of already had one of those days already when we're in Sydney. Yeah. And we had, uh, what was it, forehead? Six, six head? head. Yeah. Six head. Forehead. <laughs> That's a body part, you fucking <laughs> idiot. Uh, six head for dinner. I remember when I was sitting there, I was just like, this is like. It's pretty sweet. This this is what it is. Mm. I was talking to Darcy. <coughs> yeah. Um, and I reckon we're going to go to Mark Norman when he comes over here. Done. And 
I think we're going to get Alan Hans. Yep. And we're going to go to a steakhouse before. Oh, fuck, man. It's going to be expensive and night. Be, <laughs> and then it'll be comedy after. Oh, I can't wait. That'll be a good night. That'll be, that'll be up Don't there. you ever just plan out a great night in your head? Yeah. Like an all-time hang. Yeah. yeah. How good is a good hang? A good, a good hang, hang just... is fantastic. Yeah. And it's just... Oh, I don't know what it is. Because it's, it's simple. You're not doing much. Going out for dinner. Yeah. But then when you're with your mates... And you start just chatting shit in a really good spot. Yeah. <laughs> Elevated to another level. It's very good. What was the... We were talking about some of the most, like, not disgusting stuff, but some of the... St- I guarantee at that six head, there would have been no conversation like I was... Like, it was quite a classy... that restaurant. Yeah, it was quite a classy establishment. Yeah. We looked out of place. Oh. It was so fucking funny. Yeah. I we felt- looked so out of sorts. Yeah. I completely agree. Mm. Good spot. Go to Six Head if you want to have some good yeah. steak. Yeah, and no money. The Jewel Tomahawk. The We're doing that again. Oh, man. <laughs> that was good. Yeah, we had, that's what's, what we've decided. How We're, can you not like steak? Get on the steak. Get on the, that's That'll turn you. If you, ha, if you don't like steak, try no, that. I actually understand people not liking steak steak, like the bloody and the raw meat. It's because they've had meat. Yeah. proper steak, though. But meat in general, I don't quite get that. How can you not like chicken? Everyone loves chicken. Chicken, yeah. Like a Zinger burger. Zinger oh. burger is almost the best thing you can eat. I'm salivating. Mm. The richest people in the world go back to KFC to order Zinger burgers. <laughs> That's a, yeah, you know, bold call, but possibility. Yeah. Have you ever seen a Ferrari at a drive through No. No. It's because someone else is picking them up for them. Yeah. Oh, great They've great show. Them. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. yeah. Fuck, I've just been, oh, I can't say anything now, can I? Mm. I'm done. It's good food. Here's something I noticed. Do your parents do this as well? If you can't say, we talked about food a lot, but this is, it's not, it's related to food. So they go to the shopping center. They can't find, let's say, potato gems. They come home. Fuck, there's a potato gem shortage. <laughs> potato shortage. In Australia, there must be a potato shortage. <laughs> or you just can't find the potato gems. I haven't had that. Have you ever no. had that? Mum's come home, outrageous call. Yeah. I'm lying I'm lying on the couch, just like Mum's like, nah, potato shortage in Australia, haven't you heard? <laughs> I'm like, you just couldn't find the potato gems in one shop. <laughs> it doesn't mean the like Australia is short on potatoes. Because I know that's a lie. Mm. Did you have a uh, toilet roll shortage when it was corona? Yes. That yeah. was so we were strange. so dramatic about the toilet paper. Yeah. We were just dramatic about the whole thing. I wonder how those people are going now that bought 90,000 rolls of toilet paper. Yeah, they've still got 89,000 yeah. sitting there. It, yeah. That was the, like, of all things, toilet paper. What was it about? I don't understand. It was like doomsday kind of thing in their head. It's like, but why is get toilet all the paper the first thing? Like, we've got alternatives for that. In yeah. it, when it comes down to it, if we need it, we've yeah. got alternatives like to toilet paper. The shower. Yeah, shower. The shower, a leaf. We don't have alternatives. Leaf. Wait, 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 I would have gone whoa, to whoa. so many other things whoa. before a leaf. Yeah. Why? Just a rag. A <laughs> <laughs> rag. I would have gone to a rag before a leaf. You surely you've wiped your ass more with a leaf than a rag in this world. Yeah, that is true. Yeah. Good point. Fair enough. I never want to well wipe my ass with a leaf again. If I go through life without doing that again, I've done well. Yeah, fair enough. Fair point. Yeah, I think... Do you know how sad it is? Need to go take a shit, boys. No toilet paper. That's all right. <laughs> That's a Pine right. tree just around the corner. Pine needles. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Pine cone? Pine cone? <laughs> you'd become a pine cone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gee, you'd be da- sad times. Mm. But we've got some questions from people, I believe. Do we? Oh, yeah. We did mention questions. We thought we'd get back into this. The, uh, Do you want me to read them out? Viewer no, questions? It's all good. Got a couple of questions. Have we got a few? Yeah. We got enough? <laughs> yeah. Or do we give it time? <laughs> no, we got a couple. We can, oh, get, we can keep we talking. We can keep going. Bit. All right, we'll get to that soon. Mm. It's been good to come back on the pod. It has been. I haven't probably spoken for this long in a while. Yeah, give everyone in the world COVID or glandular fever. I reckon we're in more trouble if we give everyone glandular fever. Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually not even kidding. Yeah, because you were dead for two weeks. Yeah. Yeah, the whole world would be dead for two weeks and then fatigued for six months. Yeah, it'd be a pretty sad six months, to be <laughs> fair. Everyone would just be sad. Yeah, it'd be like the B movie. Do you know when they stop making Such money? a bad movie to reference. Dude. Literally think of any other movie and reference that. 
B movies elite. Just because Jerry's in it doesn't mean it's good. <laughs> Jerry's good. We it's, love Jerry. B movie sucks. No, it's a fantastic <laughs> film. It's got a great meaning to it. Oh, I can't listen to it properly without laughing. I can't. Yeah, because <laughs> I know it's Jerry. Yeah, and I, don't I know he'd be pissing himself reading those lines. He's probably yeah. He's reading it. He's like, what is this all about? Yeah. I wonder if anyone doesn't know that we're talking about Jerry Seinfeld right now. No. The most, one of the most famous famous comics ever. Mm. This whole podcast is kind of based off Seinfeld almost. Yeah. <laughs> Not quite. Pot about nothing. Mm. I don't want to have that label. It's pot about Kyle. Pot about just a sympathy fucking episode about <laughs> me. And I hate it. I don't need your sympathy. This is the sympathy app. Yeah. <laughs> No, I hate that. Oh, are you right? No, but Stop. what do you want me to say? No. <laughs> oh, that's what I hate. See, no, I don't know. Like I appreciate you reaching out and stuff, but like, yeah. don't everyone reach out? Mm. Too much. Is that just the most selfish thing that's ever? That's really selfish. That's selfish. Yeah, yeah, that was. That sounded really bad. Yeah, yeah. from the I'm very well. self conscious <laughs> about how I sound then, and I didn't like it. Yeah, no, because <laughs> it sound, sucks. It sounded as bad as you. probably As soon as I was did. saying it, I'm like, oh, so I suck, right? Yeah. As a human being, and that's just who I am. I often think that on this podcast, though, like, about so me. No, just some of the <laughs> okay. It's <laughs> <laughs> all right. No, some of the things... There's two that, people in this room that are thinking that yeah. anyway. <laughs> yeah, I need to go to therapy. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long two weeks. So. <laughs> no, some of the things I say, I'm like, why did I say that? Like, what was going through my head when I said that? Oh, that's Not most, a lot. Mm. Most of the time when I speak. I say some weird stuff on here that I don't like. And it it's annoying because I can't take it back. Yeah. Because you guys find it funny or embarrassing or whatever. And you're oh, like, that's yeah. staining. And I'm like, oh, that's not good. It's not a good look. Yeah. But yeah. I've got to the point now where I don't care. <laughs> yeah. Well, also. <laughs> Which like, is good. I reckon a lot of other people need to get to the point where they we say don't that every care. Episode. Yeah. We're not helping anyone. Uh, this isn't better help. Self care episode. Yeah. <laughs> Self care. Yeah. Do you want me to. Yeah. Let's do a. Fu- oh, no, I won't. I won't. Yeah. Agony yeah. Ant episode. <laughs> <laughs> not happening. <laughs> This oh. is the only episode we've done in daylight, by the way. Yeah, I know. Day app. Mm. Tell us how much you hate it. <laughs> or just hate us, because I know you do. I don't know. You said you had some stuff written down, though. Did I? Oh, yeah. Might have already burnt through it, to be honest. You've burnt through that. Mate, I haven't... Oh, do you know how... Oh, well, that was a th- When I was sick, right? Like, mm. I just lose so much energy over nothing. Carl, mm. right? sick. Yeah, just for like realize. a week. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> I'm really healthy now though. <laughs> and like I w- would think of something really funny and I'd be like, oh, let's, where's, where's my phone? Mm. And I'd spend so much energy to trying to find my phone, I'd forget what it was. And there was three times I thought like, oh, this would be funny if I brought this up because it was like so dumb that it happened to me. Oh. And I'd run out of energy or I just try and look for my phone, can't find it, give up, fall asleep. <laughs> it's so sad and pathetic. You're falling asleep a lot. Oh, last week I'd fall asleep. But for like 10, 15 minutes because mm. I was just no good. And I had a shower, right? Just having a shower. I was so tired. Like just from showering. So tired. Had to sit down. <laughs> How pathetic is that? I can't even wash myself without sitting down. That's what I got to. Well, that's what I do like, all the time. Is it weird to sit down in the shower? Yeah. I think it's the strangest thing. Like Jack's showering habits in general, the strangest I've ever seen. Spends 45 minutes in the shower. How long do you sit for though? 20? I don't think it's weird to sit in the shower. I sit in there for 15, 20 minutes just <laughs> with my own thoughts. Yeah, you think about closed. a lot, don't you, in the shower? Yeah, just water on the back of the neck. It's really good. I'm it's a big just, fan. Yeah. Are the towels not cold though? Are the towels not cold? No. What world are you living in? The towels are always like... What do you mean no, are the towels cold? the tiles. Oh, the tiles. Speak, the shower oh, tiles. Speak the king's English, mate. Dude, that's what I'm doing. Yeah, the then why did you say... Yeah, so... Yeah, well, what, you heat them up. What I'll do is, for the tiles, I grab water with my hand like a, a cup. Oh, uh, like, yeah. And I'll put them here. I'll do like five <laughs> or six chucks under the tiles. Get them wet. Get them like warm. And then I'll... 
sit on it. Sit lean on, on it. it. Yeah, lean on it. Otherwise, you've got to sacrifice it. And that's that... what I was doing because I didn't have the energy. <laughs> <laughs> the amount of time it would have taken me to fill up one and then try and throw yeah. it, I would, have been na- I would have been sweating in the shower. <laughs> yeah, it's instant warmth then. And it's, it's like when you sit on the toilet seat. It's really cold. I mm-hmm. hate doing that. Yeah, yeah, in the morning, in a winter. Ooh, oh, man, that's mm. tough sacrifice. Sitting down on a toilet seat in winter is not fun. Almost worse, though, if you sit on a warm one. Because you know someone else you was know. sitting there before you. That's not good. Yeah. On the crown. Yeah, you know on the throne. Big, juicy ass has been on it right before oh, you. Yeah. Man, Fuck I don't like this. that. I'd rather a cold one. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't been touched for at least an hour. Yeah. yeah rather a cold ski. Yeah. I, I feel weird sitting in a seat that's like it's warm from someone else. I don't mind that. I don't like it. Clothes on. That's fine. Yeah, that's fair. Clothes on. But just like sitting and I'm like, oh, someone's been, you know, <laughs> settled in here for a good 40 minutes. Someone's Not been good. nestled in. Oh, yeah. I find that weird. I hate it. This is why I never go to any toilet but my own at home. I find that strange that you can't. <laughs> You know, just... I can't go to the toilet. It's an essential skill. Yeah, if it's not at my house. That's madness to me. So I'll... What are you going to do in Europe, by the way? Because obviously you're going to Europe for... Go to my house Airbnb toilet. Uh, It always circles back to the toilet. And that will be fine. I'm so scared of someone coming in and knocking on the door. And what do you say? Yep. (laughs) No, you can say that. Someone someone Uh, opens the door. I hate that. It's so awkward. No, I don't. I don't I mind. I. I reckon it's worse for the person knocking. Don't oh, knock if the door's shut. Just wait. Yeah. How many times has a door, a toilet board door, been shut and there's no one in there? Often, I reckon. You reckon yeah. often? I have to check underneath. Slim, slim to nut. You check. You do the check underneath. I do the check. Yeah. No, we can't be checking underneath. We can't check. Locks were invented no way. for a reason, though. Yeah, but if it says, if it says vacant and it's shut. Yeah, I'm sus. Because what if he, there is someone in there? Are you doing the little... <laughs> <laughs> is it open? Kick One the door them. down? Are you doing like the... You know, the quiet... I'm shit. not looking. I look underneath. I see if there's feet there. What? Oh, but if someone sees you looking underneath... That's strange. That's ass. worse than knocking. Well, you can't look over the top. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, that's, that's frowned upon. Yeah. But if you look... Yeah, look underneath and someone sees you looking underneath. I reckon that's worse than knocking. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> right. But yeah. if you get away with the look underneath, it's perfect. Yeah, yeah it's pretty yeah. safe. You're like, oh, the shoes. Yeah, the shoes. All right, I'll wait. But I'd never get in there anyway because I don't do that if it's not it. my house. Yeah. yeah. Mm, interesting. Mm, interesting. I'll tell you what, I'm not looking forward to going back to the freezing cold of England. <laughs> Minus five degrees it was. Yeah, I'm well, yesterday yeah. in England. Yesterday. Minus five. Fuck. And that spring, it was snowing heaps. Four foot of snow. I don't understand everyone's attraction to England from here. Really? Everyone wants to go. Do you think oh, it's let's nice go to here? Europe. Let's go to Europe. You've yeah. got everything here. Everything you'll ever need. We've Europe. got like some got of the here. best beaches in the world. Driving distance You've come away. in summer. It's nice here in summer. Pretty yeah. Soon. You remember the first months you were here? September. Yeah. That was October. awful. Freezing cold. Yeah, I wanted to die. Yeah, it was terrible. <laughs> yeah. Same. That's what it's like for probably eight months here. Mm. But yeah, today's good. good. We've got the door open. Exactly. A fantastic sunset. How do you guys cope with sleeping at night when it's hot? Fan. Ceiling fan? Fan fan. This far away. Really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That Doesn't fan. Doesn't annoy you? Oh, nah. Well, I need it. You need it. I need it. Winter, I'll have it on. Mm, no, I won't have it on in winter. No, nah, not sheets. Sheets? I'm 50-50 in and out of the doona. And I'm fan on. I don't know why. I don't, I'm don't. i not a sheet guy. I just don't have sheets. I don't have sheets either. I have like the normal sheet that you put over the fucking mattress. Top sheet. Oh, nothing. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, of course we have yeah. that. Not going fucking bare balls on the, <laughs> on the mattress. <laughs> Gonna have to get a new one every two weeks. That'd be yeah. disgusting. <laughs> it's just nah. a yellow mattress. Ew. Oh, I need to have sweat. something on though. So you need to have nah, a, man, a nah. duvet on. I always sleep with a shirt on as well. Oh, you don't sleep. But what about if he's boiling hot outside? I still sleep with a shirt on. Really? Yeah, um, pants? Can't. No, undies. No shorts, yeah. Just I'm, underpants. I'm undies yeah. or boxers in the summer and then t-shirt in the winter. Yeah. That's it. Still with undies on or... Yeah. No, nah, just t-shirt. Imagine that in the winter. I can't Real shake up. I'm completely naked. I'm not naked. 
How I've got boxes or undies on. How can you sleep naked? Nah, I'm naked. Winter, summer, don't matter. I'm always naked. I'm. Sleep, I don't like the. F- I don't think I like the feeling sleeping like that. And I'm too worried about if someone comes in my room. I, yeah. I have almost been caught so many times by Jack because he Wink. never fucking knocks. <laughs> he just I don't walks like that. in my room. I don't like that. That has to be a knock. Exactly. Always has to be a knock. Yeah. I do it to but, annoy you though. I know. And that. Oh. But the anxiety. Of if I was naked in my room, I wouldn't sleep much. Dude, I'd wake up at like five just to make sure I'm the first one up. <laughs> yeah, I can't. No, nah, I'm not. I'm not getting caught. There is no way. Sleeping naked's no good. Yeah. Well, so look. many people like swear by it. No, it's it's fantastic. It's great. It's Ever been to a really nude good. beach? No. I wouldn't be. I wouldn't be comfortable going to a nude beach. I want to, but I don't. I can't. I wouldn't stop. Looking at other people's appendages. <laughs> I'm straight. I still... I'd be jealous. To, I have to have a peek. Yeah. Yeah, no, you can't... No. Yeah. I can't look at someone. Hunter was telling me this yesterday. Oh, here we go. He's been thrown under the bus. <laughs> <laughs> well, footy change rooms. Oh, yeah. Footy change rooms, highest level, AFL, whatever. They all just get it out and no one talks about it. Yeah. And they all talk to each other, pretty close to each other. Yeah. And it's just out. I do think, though, if you make it weird, I, it's weird. I don't know how yeah. to do that. If you don't... I'd, I'd have to get the fuck out of there straight yeah, away. That's yeah. the exact same as local football, like my football. You get it out. Yeah, I guess. No! Yeah. Well, you what? well, not in front of everyone. When I'm in the shower. Yeah. But the showers are open. They're open showers. Yeah. yeah. And it just doesn't matter. I'm just talking. No! <laughs> it's not like I'm like, hey, oi, you know, how's it going? That was a good game, wasn't it? Like, I'm not... You know, nah, you just I can't do that. I'm sorry. Anything. Maybe I'm weird. But you're not like but hiding in the corner because then someone will that's the say thing. something. Also, I think if you don't shower, like I, nobody really showers at cricket here because everyone lives pretty local. But mm. like back at home, you have to have to shower because you've got like a 40 minute train journey home or like a 40 minute car journey home. Do you know what I mean? So mm. everyone showers. So, but if you make it, and like if you're the guy that's not showering, it's just strange as why you're not showering. What have nah, you tried? I'd rather you not shower because you think it's weird than be the guy that showers and makes it weird. Yeah, oh, 100%. I'd rather you not shower. No, if yeah, you're going to be like that, don't shower. Yeah. But if you're going to shower, don't be weird. Yeah, don't be weird. Because instantly. About it. it is weird. How can you not say it's weird? Everyone's got their cock out <laughs> and everyone's just talking to each other like it's a normal conversation. It is. So, like, we're having a normal conversation right now. If I just whipped it out, yeah, no worries. Don't even talk about it. Well, I think I it's would, the same thing. I'd find it funny if you did it. What, like, say we all played in the same footy team. And I did it. And you came in the showers. I'd piss myself laughing because I knew how, I'd know how uncomfortable you were. <laughs> I and, couldn't do it, yeah. And I just, I just have to tell everyone. I'm like, just go say something to Jack about it. <laughs> go say something to Jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> look at him like, jeez, nah. that looks weird. It's not like we're walking around the change rooms, though. Like, you got towels on and stuff. I'd just and be you're decent. I'd have to sneak a peek for everyone, I, for whatever reason. You'd be the guy in the corner, just like looking around, yeah, scanning. Like, oh, there's a mushroom. There's an ant eater. There's That's an absolute an hog. That there's GL. an absolute hammer. Yeah. yeah. Oh, gee, Carl's packing. Oh, yeah. gee. There's like two coke cans on top of each other. Yeah. I oh. couldn't not think about that. It's, that's the way it is. Well, I guess you've never done it, so you just never... I don't know. I feel like, you know, you'd, I reckon you'd be like that for like the first or second... Maybe first or second time. Yeah. And then after that, you'd just be like, I'm just having a shower. But yeah, yeah. it's also the just same... Just pass me the soap. Same in Europe. You share the soap? I'm sure you... you don't <laughs> share the soap in there. <laughs> there's, sure. No, there's body wash. Everyone gets a, you know, a squirt. Yeah, we all get it. Oh, God. Don't <laughs> see, you know what I mean? We all share the body wash. squirts that bad. I don't like it. Why? There's something about it. It's just like, oh, that's not right. Well, it's not wrong. It's just not clean. Mm. Squirt's not a clean word. There's lots of words that aren't clean. Like good words. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Yeah, but going again, back to the point. In Europe, they have topless beaches. Like in Spain. Isn't lot. that... Hang on, pause. Isn't that every beach? No. Topless beach? No, I'm talking about women. For females. Women, oh, women only topless beaches. No, 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 no. Women bathe topless in Spain. 
a lot of women bathe topless. Why are we not in space? <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's that's the thing again. Like, you don't want to be the guy that's fucking looking at everyone's titties. You know, there's a thing called sunglasses. But like, so it's normal. You're not supposed to look. No. Well, you don't look because you don't care. Exactly. It's the mentality. Yeah. So you've seen like we it care, that many but times. Like we shouldn't care if we go to those like, beaches. If, you, if you're there, you've seen it that many times that it's not that deep anymore. Okay. Yes, that's what it is. Do you know what it's I not mean? that deep. Right, so, so the first visit's a big visit. Yeah, well, I was 12 when I first went to... That's Ibiza. crazy. Your head was on a swivel. So I was fucking pinging. Swinging. Yeah, I was literally... Like, Sore neck. Had to see the chiropractor that night. Yeah. Like, what on earth is going around? Uh, like, what is going on yeah. here? Yeah. Yeah. What's in the water? It was It was heaven. Mm. To a newly... Like, a, a growing up teenager. Mm. Yeah. yeah. It was the heaven. I don't know. Nude beach, I couldn't I couldn't get out on a nude beach. Maybe if I was with someone I was really comfortable with. I couldn't do it if I knew people. She there. she was nude and she's like, Jack get now. I'm like, fuck whatever. Fine, oh. I'm going in, whatever. Oh. Other than that, no, nah, not happening. <laughs> Carl, uh, you do it. No, nah, I wouldn't. <laughs> I, I'm going my own to a spot I if I knew no one would like no one I know was there. That's just not realistic, but like, if I, like, I don't have a desire to go to a nude beach, but if I was going to, it'd be somewhere with, on my own without any, like, and I wouldn't know anyone else at the beach well, and I, you, then I wouldn't care at all. Like somewhere like Venezuela or somewhere. Yeah, let's go to, literally no, no one's going to know Literally you. going to Venezuela just to go to a nude beach. <laughs> what would you do at the nude beach? I would literally do nothing. I'd do the exact same. So just sit there and tan, yeah, with it out. What I guess, yeah, it out. Swim. Oh yeah, that'd be nice. Swim. Swim would be good. Swim I'd be feel un- comfortable in the water, not out the water. Yeah, mm. great. Yeah, interesting. Is it uncommon to go to a nude beach and swim? Surely not. Oh, that's an interest. No, I guess it's just like a normal. You do it's a normal like beach, it. but you're not going. Like, isn't the point of like nude beaches just to be lying there nude, kind of thing, and relaxing? But also then you're, ex- you're still experiencing the nature. Gee, this just shows how ignorant I am of nude beaches. There's no clue. <laughs> <laughs> Why, well, you go on the water in a nude beach? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking of course you do, you idiot. Yeah, it's just like to go back to like your roots, isn't it? Of like what we used to do when we were uncertain. Not mm. uncertain. Oh, it's what now. We used to do, right. Now, what, what we used now to we've do lost the plot. Now, we've lost <laughs> now no, if no. we're talking about our ancestors no. at a nude beach. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> No, like what we used to do like in the past before clothes and shit like that. Like that's how we'd wash. Yeah, that's thing. how we would live. That's how we would wash. Whoa. Whoa. Let there be light. That's the do not touch button. I forgot to turn the lights on. It was on my face, so it's all right. That's okay. Mm, nude beach, I don't know. What about if you get I a got hide on? I reckon go for it. I love the idea. Yeah, do it. I don't care. People want to be nude on the beach. Fucking go for it. Mm, yeah. Do whatever you want. Feel free. Yeah. Right. I'm going to say that again. What about if you get a hide on? Whilst you're at a new beach. I don't think that's... Go in the water. Yeah, go in the water. Or just lie upside down in your towel. <laughs> just pretend you're tanning your back. You can't do that. No. One nah, that. but I reckon, I reckon it's more common than you think. Yeah. But you just like... You just have to ignore it. And just... Because yeah. I feel like people obviously... Like, I reckon it happens... A bit, and everyone's just like... I don't know anyone that goes to a nude beach. Me neither. Oh, I know people that have been to nude beaches. Mm. But like... Is it frowned upon to go fully clothed? I f- yeah, I feel like it's like, what are you doing here? Mm. Like, if you go into a nude beach, you're nude. That's you know what I mean? That's really strange. That, that's you're like, fully clothed, just then. go to a beach if you're clothed. Mm-hmm. You don't yeah. go to the nude beach. So you get weird looks if you went just with bodies on. Maybe I think so. yeah I think so. It'd be frowned upon. I think obviously it's cause it's not, let's get this guy. It's not your lane kind of thing. Imagine yeah. getting attacked by that's twenty nude word. people. <laughs> We're in just running down the. Oh, beach imagine just oh, beach. dude! Imagine just seeing them run at you. Yeah. <laughs> that would put you to bed. That would knock you out cold. I'd run. <laughs> I would. Jokes. Oh man! No, you wouldn't. You'd be having a peek. <laughs> You'd be <laughs> like, "Fighty hell! What is going on here?" Mm. That one's flailing in the wind. <laughs> oh man. Mm. All right, we got some questions, yeah, surely. Some questions. Just questions to finish her off. Um, Henry we've been going. Asks a question. We've been going for an hour and seventeen minutes. Ah, that's pretty wow. good. Henry asks, "What's your go-to brekkie when you have no time? Because I'm sick of eating porridge." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Oh well, 
wait, how much? Uh, so this is tough. How much time? Have I, if if I'm really like if I really have no time, I'm just having a coffee. Mm. But I don't count that as breakfast. So toast. I'm a toast yeah. guy. Toast or crumpets or English muffins, whatever's in the bread basket. I'll Chuck it in the toaster. Yeah. Mm. Once that's done, grab it and go. Mm. Hi yeah. Henry, hope you're well. Um, <laughs> mine's probably a, <laughs> a, a petrol station sausage roll with tomato sauce. Gee, what you're not even making your own. No. I'm wow. Not. Or an English muffin with Nutella on. English muffins are so good. Yeah. Yeah. English muffins are delicious. Or a drive-through. Good Why question, not? Henry. Good yeah. question. Porridge, God, kill me. Um, Maddie asks, "How do I get Kyle to fall in love with me?" Well, that's not getting in. Or we're beeping it, or just like, <laughs> or we can just move on. Yeah, we can just away. move on. Let's Here's just move one on. About Kyle. Oh, Jamie asks, "Would Kyle ever go out with a listener asking for a friend?" Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Kyle's got some fan girls, eh? What's going on here, mate? I had a couple last time, and now it's you. Oh, you're what's switched. going on? I don't like it. As if they're not completely they like it. repulsed by me. <laughs> they've said some dis- just stupid shit. I said to nude people at a nude beach, go in the water. <laughs> you don't think I'm an idiot? Then Are you come on. Answer? The next question. Next question. <laughs> um, Faith says, "Will Kyle come to Australia if I buy him a plane ticket?" <laughs> You can buy me a plane ticket, well, but I'm Kyle already... Will come to Australia if I buy him a plane ticket? Yeah. You're in Australia. Chances I'm already there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good ticket. Buy me a ticket to London or something. That'd be good. <laughs> what buy a... me a return Why is it so... Oh, Kyle, it's because I ask questions, ask Kyle questions. Oh. That's why it's all about you. Uh, I don't like sense. that. Um, what does Ted Danson have that I don't ask Darcy? Danson. Ted Danson? Yeah. Is that a Seinfeld thing? Ted's, yeah. Ted's dancing. Ted Good. dancing. You know the actor? No. Nah. You've never heard of Ted dancing. Can we? Can I search him up? Who's Ted dancing? The Cheers guy, Samuel Mayday Malone. Oh, that the bloke. Cheers. Yeah. Oh God, I can't stand him. You don't like Ted dancing? Ted, Dan- if he's the one I'm thinking of, you're not Ted dancing. I thought you're it was not Ted be like dancing. Anyway, that's spot. not a bad shout then. If that's the yeah, okay. It's Seinfeld anyway. Oh but, yeah, I told you. Then yeah, I wouldn't know. Um, next question. How many five-year-olds could you beat in a fight? Oh, Ooh, that's a good question. question. Really? Now, so this is what I'm talking about. I want to know, I want this kind of stuff. Mm. Not just like fight scenarios, but just, you know, some weird shit. Um, how many five-year-olds? Okay. So five. Mm, okay. So they're like. I reckon I could take six on at once. Six at once? Nah, I think that's just too many bodies, to be honest. I think six is too many bodies. Right. This is going to sound horrendous. But surely you could just like kick them and then the majority of it's done. That's like, what I was thinking. A big kick. Like, cow. Just, you, no, you just, just imagine though. Yeah, I understand. But like imagine they just somehow all get a grab at you at once. How many would it take you to shake them all off and like win that fight? Because well, that's what I'm imagining. I'm like, say they all get me. And they've all got a hand on me. Mm. How many is too many for me to shake off and try and beat? Yeah. Because that's that's the, that's, that's the scenario. Yeah, great scenario. You're almost stuck on that so, one. So, but, so if they're on both of your legs, you've got two fists. So you can punch two of them at once. <laughs> right. So that's then kind of gone. And so, again, so we I, got, said, I said at the start, this is going to sound bad. I think we can easily get four. It, four's no worry. Four's done. Four, five-year-olds, we're good. Yeah. But then... Six, I think six, no more than eight. I also think, how much damage is a five-year-old really going to inflict on you? Yeah, this is the thing. Biting and scratching, I reckon, is the only thing, and pinching. Yeah. That's a good no shout. they power. Yeah. Yeah, there's no power. So if one's got your finger in their mouth and they're chomping away... Yeah, no, that's effective. That's almost white flag. Like, I don't want to lose my finger. Yeah. But that's the thing I don't feel like they get there. That like, yeah, that's also true. They're five. Yeah. <laughs> They're five. No, nah, if I'm in fight mode, do you know what I mean? Like, I reckon ten, maybe. I also think I reckon eight. I, I reckon eight some max. Ten. We're talking ten. Line them up, that's a few. Ten, they all get a hold of you at once. Even if they like pin you down into submission. I reckon ten. 
Right, this conversation is making me really uncomfortable now from what I've just said. <laughs> okay. So let's think of them as goblins. Oh. <laughs> no, that's not helping. I reckon we've settled on 10. Yeah, 8 to 10. Dan, it's 10. Okay. we got 10. We can take 10. Dan asks, did you get glandular fever from kissing too many mamacitas? Oh, <laughs> what did I say at the very start? Thanks, mate, for chipping in. <laughs> I've only heard that five million times. <laughs> Hope you've been well, though, and keep listening, I guess. Love Dan. Yeah, good on you, Dan. Um, last one, Elliot asks... Oh, that's Dan Dan, isn't it? Dan Dan. Oh, Dan, we love Dan. Yeah. Sorry for being a smart ass. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hit me. Elliot asks, Reds to win the flag, yes or no? It's my cricket team. Yeah, yeah, of course. Both of them. Big night for both of you, and then probably me. Grand and then I'll be sick for a bit. Yeah. So excited. If you, if you win, if you both win, I'll have a big night. Mm. Fuck the glandular fever. Yeah, no, nah, I can wait a week. Yeah. And yeah I can recover next week. week. Yeah, exactly. I do think about that. I'm like, what has to happen for me to just to sacrifice it and just be like, stuff it? If I make some runs, we'll be pretty happy. Do you, do you make for some runs? Do you, hey, runs this week? 12. That's Almost a thousand balls. Start. So we made a start. Yeah. 13 maybe. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well. That's cricket though. We That's love cricket. cricket. It was a good 13 though, yeah. from what I've heard. It was a necessary 13. There you go. Mm. Well, that's all you need. Necessary runs. String. Thanks for the strapper car. That's all right, mate. Can't have one. I, oh, can I be honest? I almost cried before because he grabbed one of my strappers, my birthday present. I said, you know what? You can have it. I can't drink for a while. The Jack bought them. Yeah, he bought me the them. strappers and he's having mine. Yeah, that's, no, I said you can have mine. That's all good. by them somehow. Yeah, we need them to sponsor them. But that would be awesome. There is no, nothing has made me more sad than he asked me if I wanted one. I told him I just couldn't have one. So he comes over here, takes my stubby holder. <laughs> Cracks open my beer, oh, has a sip, well. and he's like, "Oh, that that!" I almost cried. Honestly, I was about, I was this close of crying. I Never love it when sad. people are sad and upset. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> no, nah, I don't mind it. Like I, I'm, I don't go the same way as you, but I don't mind it when you're just like, "No, nah, that's just funny because it's fucked." It takes attention off. It, it take like yeah, because I, I don't <laughs> like it if it goes too far the other way. No, uh, no one's ever, happy with too far. Yeah, and they're like, oh, fuck, man. Yeah. Like, I don't want to kill the mood. Yeah. Still do what you do. I'm just going to be about three steps behind you. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> going to Pies Geelong this Friday. Oh, I, yes. I was looking at getting tickets. You going to that? Tom's first ever AFL yeah. game. Huge. Very excited. Mm. Update next week on that one. Update, yeah. I'm going to try and find tickets to that, actually. Mm-hmm. And we're recording in two days, so people stay tuned. Yep. Thanks for listening. Yeah, shit. We're good. We're good for time. We're good for time. No way. Sun's yeah. still up. The Wilkinsons are asleep. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, d- don't call Brett. He's <laughs> he in bed. He'll be in bed. Henry might come on soon. So keep an eye yeah, out, Henry. Yeah, got some, just some mates coming on. Mm. We're not, yeah, no guests, just mates. Yeah. <laughs> we're just chill. We're just going to do no the same thing. I'm done with the interviews. No, nah, we don't need interviews. You don't care. <laughs> no, okay. Well, I don't care. So let's just, you know, chew the fat. Mm. I think that's pretty, pretty simple. Yeah. Oh, well, sign her off. Yeah, we're done. Thanks for listening. Thank you, Tommy. Thanks, Tommy. No problem. Appreciate it, brother. Nox, you'll be back. He'll be back soon. In two days. Yeah. yeah. It's all good. The world is fine. I'm alive. Yeah. I want to kill myself. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. All right. See you, fellas. Bye.